privacy matters watu wengine sasa kibe hata hiyo jina konao la mystic si ya jina la mystic ngoja wapi la mystic gang wameenda wapi wakuja 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 jina si yake ameiba hapo acha jina ni akina mashaa na nyaga hebu ambieni kibe acha kuiba jina la mystic bana kibe kibe manzi You guys remember the lambistic nation man. Ndoi lambistic. Waje kujida. Sasa juzi alikuwa anajita Andrew Kibe. Sasa ni lambistic. Sisi akanifanya hata a few episodes za lambistic na sisi saa hizi. Sasa mzee wa miaka 50 anakuja kukopi vijana. Kibe ni yeye pio ni us. Pio ni us lambistic shit. Kwanza Fagilia TV wanafagia news zote. Wanakuletea vitu moto moto. Subscribe to Fagilia TV. Yeah, the Pluto yeah. the last time mm. uh, we did an exclusive interview yeah. you talked about you know transitioning from a uh, mm. lot test yeah. to some other yeah. different type of uh, content yeah. Yeah. but na nyinyi mkaandika stories za uongo mkasema ati nimesema ni the end of loyalty test hata kama ni visit tunatafuta bloggers bana ni poa sometimes kupatiana the the truth eh? mimi nilisema tuna diver kuna kitu mpya inakuja tu kusema tumemaliza loyalty test na ndio maana niliingia pale later na nikaambia watu hizo ni porojo okay. si tulisema something new is coming we didn't say that you are going to destroy the old mm. oh, yeah. na sasa hizi mambo iko sawa like uh, uh, setup zote tumechapa we have all the equipments everything is ready whatever right now tunafanya uh, tuko in the final stages ya kutafuta actors and actresses kwa sababu kuna zile ages because my content inachukua all ages kuna like na kupata mtu wa 60 years a lady who can act so well. I mean it's a this time I'm so selfish about it na hand pick not auditioning. Yes. You hand pick randomly. I'm hand picking. For, are you yeah. hand picking randomly from mm. Instagram or uh, what anyway, what anyway, from are you using? Anyway you get talent bro. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay thanks. Mm. Uh, exclusively from this interview mm. I'd like you to you know mm. to tell the press man mm. what type of content are we moving into? Ngojeni itakam. Eh. Ilombia just to it for it he come. Na before even tufanye such contents eh tutafanya launch is a contents. Mm. Because uh ile time to kwa tuna launch is a contents we are going to release a minimum of 5 videos hiyo siku. Yeah, so say a minimum of 5 ama 10 videos hiyo siku yenye tuta launch is a contents. Wow. Uh, awesome. mm. Yeah. So Pluto tumekuwa okay. na pale sorry mm. tumekuwa na pale na unawak na Mangwe mm. so maybe are you planning to get into politics mm. already seen going into politics mimi niko azimio la umoja hiyo si ati ni kitu ya siri tuendelea ku support kazi yenye kwenye uhuru ndio ambia tuende mimi naenda hiyo mm-hmm. uh, na usitafita ya kuingia mm. running mate wa Mangwe ah si size hizi mm. size hizi mimi siko ready sio lazima Saizi mimi sitaingia siasa. Saizi ni ile tu unajua mimi nilisema unajua sometimes lazima you must be under an umbrella so that you can learn how to do things. Ndio. Wewe ndio tunafanya vita tunasimama siku moja unasema pia unataka kiti. Sometimes you have to learn how things are done. Ndio. So you have to stay chini, learn, uone venye vitu zinafanywa. Ndio ile siku utakuwa unafanya zako at least uko na ideas. Hii siasa itaki tu nakimbilia vitu. Yeah. But so, mm. uh, at some point of your life mm. utaingia into politics. Ah, very lazima. Kutoka 2027 tuta decide. Utaingia, utaingia mm. juja. Uh, Tutajua hiyo time. Eh. Uh. Okay, um mm. your friend mm. uh, mwenye alikuwa offer 1 million to shave his dreads. Mm. Uh, I'd, I'd like I'd like to know mm. at what point did mm. it click to you? Mm that unafaa ku shave hizo hizo dreads mm. ndio get your meter like ili click aje unajua mm. i gave many reasons mm-hmm. many reasons eh za ku karanyuele and i said eh? most importantly was uh, that part unajua bro eh like um, tunasema anga there is no second chance for the first impression si ndio mm-hmm. right now when you nitakuwa na for the first time that is how i'm going to judge you Bro nimekuwa pia na issues kadhaa hapa na pale. Unajua mimi mi, uh, like my main hustle ni real estate, kuuza manyumba na mashamba, si ndio? <laughs> Sometimes unapata client wa more than 50 years na ni madhe. Kitu ya kwanza na kujaja kiona earrings, akiona dread. So unajua kuna ile unafanyanga follow up ya client. Unaweza hadi fanya follow up hadi akuchukulie simu. Alishajaja kwa na yeye ni kijana anataka kunibia do. Una get? So sometimes pia biz hustle kuna venye inafanya Said it ready ni mbaya but in even society 
inajaji mse yako na trade mwingine ashao na wewe ni mvuta bangi so sometimes when uh, you start aligning yourself to corporates and uh, very official businesses hautaambiwa ndo na mtu unyoe doji pala tu makata so yeah. ilifikia climax gani mm. as in msali comment mm. eh ukasema mazee lazima mm. ni mm. shave your dread okay last year on uh, on uh, november nilifanya baadhi ya november november tulikuwa tumepata nilikuwa nimepata yeah. licenses za uh, my company eh yeah. mm-hmm. ito some house real estate consultants eh? lakini tulikuwa tumefanya some registration vibaya so kaka nika cancel hizo licenses zote so we had to redo the processes nikasema i'm redoing everything to refurnish the offices and all that mm-hmm. so nimekuwa nikiuza nikifanya kazi and other companies and not my company just because iko na hizo mm-hmm. credentials zote mm-hmm. but now unaona sasa hizi tuko fully nini fully registered mm-hmm. very soon we are going to go big launching the company and all that sasa unaona ku deal na clients sasa nimekuwa niki pia wase wengi job eh? wana nisaidia ku deal na clients msemeni ati atachapa suti nini nini but I'm the man behind it unaona so, so sometimes it's good at all unakuwa pale yeah, unatiki yeah, kazi nini nafa sure. yeah so una, uh, like kazi zingine tuna deal na my expatriates msemeni yeah. kuja Kenya maybe ni wa UN ni nini amekuja kuna vitu mbili tatu mnafaa kushughulikia uh, na unakuta ni msetu ako na suti yake pale yeah. ni mzee tu fulani ako ma 40s kuna ile tu kuna ile tu first impression mm. inakonga tu na ile inakonga tu na ile respect yake so unaget mm. eju kama hakujui ajui wewe ni pluto yeah, anajua nyinyi umekuja kufanya biashara yeah, then some ni biashara ya domingi mna mm. so unaget tu uh. awesome so uh, there is a question kuhusu the interview to leona uh. and say ali say mark already we kill 10 million mm. appreciate really zako ni za rudisha like it's not about it's not only about money hiyo yeah. 10 million naweza mpe hata mimi 10 million. Uh, uh. So it's not about money. Uh. Another question. Eh? Mm. Nimekuwa nikipitia most of your content. Yeah. And uh, there kuna vile yani kuna fan alisema. Oh. Uh. Uh, Pluto reply my comment. Eh? Mm. Ngina akakuja akamwambia that Pluto mm. doesn't reply comments. Uh-huh. Hata love uh, IAC kapati. Mm. Mimi akiona kitu kimeongelewa kwake mahali. Mm. ya But wewe msi unaona kabisa kabisa wewe msi amechukua time yake ku reply hiyo ndo unaenda una una reply una reply so naget bro hiyo ni common sense wewe reply ati zote hata ukisema ni kuna you don't have that time hata ukisema ni kutoka asubuhi hadi jioni utamaliza the pluto okay. apo kwa mm. kampuni yako mm. Mm. Like the one for real estate mm. summers mm. uh, kwa wale watu ambao like they are good in real estate maybe mm. kwa self mm. um, wanaweza reach out to aje kwako mm. ndio maybe in case una haya mm. or maybe wanaweza nini sell mm. mm. wanaweza reach out to aje kwako honestly sasa hizi ni kana wasi watu wa job sita danganya so mm. not tired not tired so i'd like to know before fagilia tv mm. I'd like to know uh, the Pluto. Mm. Uh, since uh, the, all the cameras are seeing like you are getting all that money. Mm. You are living a fancy life. Mm. I'd like to know how mm. you are giving back to the society. Mm. Yeah. Bro, I have a children's home in Kawangware. In ito Kawangware Initiative Center. When is the last time you had me say that I want you guys to give me money to feed those kids? Nataka muniambe ukweli. But you ngoja tell me the truth. Ulisikia mbara ya mwisho nikisema nikisema lini watu wanipe pesa? Jibu. Okay, okay, sijai sikia but mm. you never eh, talk to the press. Mm. Ukasema ati uko na yeah. Sasa bro kwa nini ndakuja niseme nasaidiana kila mahali? Si unasaidia na unaambia Mungu akubariki. Lakini unajua mm. sisi ni mafans wako tunafaa kujua. Bro sikatai lakini sasa every time ukisaidia kwa nini utakuja waambia watu ulisaidia? Huh? Bro that's my way of giving back to the society and uh, tumekuwa na siati sikuangi na hiyo doa ti kila time ati sometimes eh inakuwa ng tricky ju i remember there is a time tulikuwa na faku raise school fees ya domob sana sasa hizi hata last week ya madhe alikuwa amenikola kaniambia wewe kuna vitu hakuna nikamwambia nitamtumania 
kaniambia tanki zimeisha maji nikatuma do but bro hautakuja hapa hivi kwa camera useme atulituma do unaona wale ni na watu 51 bro si mchezo so sometimes unaweza pata ule wa Luisha akuja ukusaidia do fulani akwambia hii sikumia watu hii hiyo unakuwa hiyo ni bahati yako si ndio mm. kuna hilo te, kitambo nilikuwa naambiwa si nisaidieni tuende nini nini mm. lakini unakuta unapanga event wasee tukienda huko unakuta wasee watadishi nini na kwa ile ndo yenye ulitoa so mbili ndo umekuja ukadishi so si ritu tu hiyo tu sana usikamu kwa hiyo event ichukule yote na watu wewe so kuna mwenye anataka hivyo unaona so mimi nikasema ile yenye niko nayo acha tuniwasaidie wenye Mungu ataniweze mm. lakini we don't shout yeah. una get si tunaamini blessings tu zitakamu yeah. yeah. true and still on uh, giving back to the society mm. i'd like to know uh, experience yako ile nye mm. ule ipatana nayo msaki msaka mm. kauliza help fulani mm. eh mpaka ikakuumiza kabisa mm. ukasema guy mm. i wish I'd, uh, i wish I'd, i was to help this person unaona mimi nimebeli wase kutoka kwa sel nimesaidia wase kulipa rent venye tu tile park bro alisema le kuwezi kuja uki announce kila time na sometimes na kuanga boring mzee akishinda kikomba doge what sometimes hizi tunahitaji hiyo doge pia mimi niko na mahitaji pia mimi na, na, na lipa rent na fuel nafanya vitu zingine pia mimi niko na nahitaji hata nahitaji hiyo doge labda hata sometimes nahitaji kuliko venye wewe unahitaji niko na wase bro wana ni depend here for living unaona nahitaji kutoa hizo madoa unaona so like hiyo kuomba doge kwa wangu fiti juga mata venye ni receive hiyo doge like dm ilikuwa imejaa kutoka juu mzee Adwo dona it shadow. So uh, thanks so, uh, the last mwisho, question from Fagiria TV. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Mm. Yeah. 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 Yeah hadi kwa wengi wawili kwani wenye wana shoot hizo hizo picha wako hapo unajua vitu zingine ni common sense eh unajua watu wanaona ni kama tumefungiwa na mhesh kwa room <laughs> kwani wenye anachukua picha yako nje ya room eh? you know you should first understand that the husband to mhesh is my friend unaona mhesh is my friend and uh, friends to to azimio la umoja ni marafiki wangu pia si ndio sasa na sasa Unajua uwezitaje huyu husband wake na jina? Mbona tuingie kwa privacy matters watu wengine? Sasa Kibe hata hiyo jina Konao Lambistic si yake. Jina Lambistic ngoja. Wapi Lambistic gang? Wameenda wapi? Wakuja wakuja wakuja. Jina si yake. Ameiba. Jina ni yake na mashaa na nyaga. Hebu ambieni Kibe aache kuiba jina Lambistic. Bana Kibe. Kibe mwanzee. Noi. You guys remember the Lambistic. Noi Lambistic. Waje kujida. Sasa Jose alikuwa na jita Andrew Kibe. Mm. Na Sisi kufanyanga hata a few episodes za Lambistic yeah. na si saa hizi. Sasa yeah. mzee wa miaka 50 anakuja kukopi vijana. Kibe ni yeye pia ni us. Pia ni us. Lambistic shit. Unajua hii ni episode. Hii ni episode. Lakini hawezi. Aende aende apige show. Atafute dish, atafute dish. Nilisha jina Kibe. Mafans wetu wote, mafans ya Meiba. Mafans wetu wote wako na hizi t-shirt. Wewe Kibe. Na tunajua amewekwa na mnyanya. Juzi alipita akiwa live tuliona. Kama ana kila tu. Si Juzi. Jana alipita. Jana na huo mama alipita hivyo akiwa live akisema ati oh Bruto amepoa pesa na mnyanya. Sasa si tuliona. Nilikuwa hapo nikiangalia. Naache kuficha kipara. Unajua hiyo kufia kitoni kipara. We the only lambistic gang alive mwanze. Sasa mmesikia kibe. Sasa imeona akiongea vizuri kwa mdomo anayekala hivi. Na kibe adresiwa ndio hiyo okay guys tunamalizia because time is up tumemaliza i guess tumeshamaliza time is up yeah sawa ndio swali ya mwisho swali ya mwisho message to this this lady wa boy being my message to her asasi mimi na wish all the best manze kanairo tunasema agal toto anaitwa agal toto ikidu tushinde asubuhi na mapema Eh hey, manzi na unajua ni mseu support u support ma young ma youth man bro what is a hizo kia kai event uite ngoinganga manzi utamuona hapo wako si wadanganyi mimi nakwambia ukweli 
Naambi ukweli eh si wadanganyi. Hiyo ni mse like anachukulia interest za wamama, watu disabled, ma youth men, anachukulia hizo ni interest zao at heart. Eh mimi ni mse najua na siwezi wadanganya. Eh Akibe Kibe kibe ni fala tu. <laughs> okay. Unajua yeah. kibe, acha let me address kibe. Now I'm addressing kibe as a like human. Eh? Yes. Um nani alimwambia? Anaitwa nani? Oga. Oga di top. Oga obena. Aliambia aliambia kibe na akaambia vijana, the problem is not even kibe. The problem is even those guys on wanajifanya fans wa kibe. Because they are pretending kibe to be the savior, but kibe is not the savior. Sasa mimi uh, ju niko na ile kitu ndogo yenye niko nayo kibe anda kuonyesha my youths that at your 20s where's the ngene za pesa goli like even ndo anajaribu kuambia my youths mimi nakwambia kama wewe ni youth man pesa unaweza tengeneza we have so many examples niko na marafiki wangu wengi wako wa, akina states akina Nairobi West sio ndo watu they are a good example to the youth na wako na wako na wako 20s ndio na wanafanya ako, akina Monga Eves ndio Eh, na wengine wenye akina wengine waitwa mugenda wengine ndio hawa kumaanisha pesa unaweza shika 10 years ndio lakini usikuwe kama kibu unaenda kuweka na mshosho huko majuu alafu sasa hapo ndo unapata rest game yako unatulia unaangalia mavijana ndio utusiana mimi nakwambia kama akikui maana i know you are older than me probably even older than my father but nitakwambia kitu kuna kutairi mwili na kutairi akili <laughs>